of uh, taking the picture of Hector Peterson, um, the copyright was not mine. Yeah. Because the, the rule of that time was that uh, when you're working for a newspaper, whatever you take as a photographer, yeah. you know, the, camera, the camera was my camera. Yeah. But uh, the, the copyright or the negative of that time, you know, we're using films, they would belong to the world newspaper. After I took in the picture in June 16, 1976, I was told that uh, the copyright was not yours, but they sold the picture the way they wanted all over the world. Yeah. I couldn't get anything from that. Nin 1998 is then that uh, I got my copyright. The reason of getting the copyright was that uh, the company that I was working for was Agas Group. The Agas Group sold the, the newspaper, the Star, yeah. to the uh, independent newspaper. Yes. Uh, the, the World and the Star, that were sister papers, okay. owned by the Agas Group. Okay. So when the Agas Group sold the, the newspaper to the independent newspaper, the independent newspaper then said, no, this is ridiculous. Yeah. We can release the copyright to you, Mr. Zima. But uh, uh, in the letter, they regretted that uh, it's too late now, I, I won't make money out of that. Yeah. But uh, funny enough, the picture is gaining an interest of, uh, from everybody. Yes. The demand is very high yes. from the people. Yes. After you took the photograph, we believe that the security police um, were trying to prevent you from taking any further photographs because they saw you as a threat. Yes, uh, the, the, the threat was that uh, uh, they gave an instruction to the police that uh, wherever I find uh, Sam Zima taking the pictures, you must shoot at him, kill him. Then he will come back here and fill the, uh, the, let, the, the form that uh, it was a straight bullet, we're not aiming at him. Yeah. And the, indeed the police who was in charge of the, that uh, police group, they phoned me to tell them that I must choose between my job and my life. So the irony of that case is that you were the photographer, you didn't own the copyright, and the police wanted to kill you because the photograph was sold overseas without your permission and without you benefiting from that picture at all in any way. Yes, I did not benefit from the picture. Yeah. But they thought that I'm the copy, copyright owner of that picture. Yeah. I saw the picture of the communist country. Yeah. That was their belief, yeah. yet it wasn't. It, so since I took that picture, I did not have any control over that picture. Yeah. So the editor and the company was running the show, selling the picture all over the world, wherever they want to. Uh, I wrote the letter to the Agas group to ask for a copyright. They say, no, I put in the act. You are not allowed to own that copyright. The copyright is ours. Uh, I took a picture in 1976. All these years, the copyright was not mine. The profit and all they sell, they sold the picture to the whole world. And the picture, the demand was very, very high at that time. They sold the picture all over the world and they made money out of it and made nothing from the, that picture. Do you think that um, if the copyright law in South Africa was changed, where those clauses were taken out so that photographers do own the copyright to their works by default, regardless of whether they're employed or not, do you think that that would benefit photographers? Yes, I wish that can be done as soon as possible because you are being robbed and you risk, I risked my life to take that picture. Yeah. And then the company that I'm working for, they own the copyright, but they never take any risk to take the picture. Yeah. I risked my life, I took that picture, and then that picture destroyed my future in journalism. Yeah. Uh, no, I, I left journalism because of that picture, because the police were now harassing me, they wanted to arrest me for that. It's so, no, we're happy if you can really get rid of this clause that says the copyright belongs to the company that you're working for. Yeah. Thank you. You will sign that petition also. Thank you. It's to support your move. Thank you. Mm. Okay, thanks. Right.